Kendall, the decision on these tax increases would no longer be up to the voters. Yeah, that's right, Joyce. And some people I heard from today weren't happy about that. But if approved, the decision goes to city and county leaders to make that vote on raising the sales tax. The sales tax in the city of Milwaukee sits at 5.5%. I like to shop when I come to Milwaukee be because it's not 10%. An agreement between Governor Tony Evers and Republican lawmakers on a funding bill would allow the city to increase sales tax by 2% and allow the county to tack on another 0.4% bringing sales tax in the city up to 7.9%. From 5.5 to 7.9, I mean, what first comes to mind when you hear those numbers? That's a big number. That's not that's not a small number. That's that's a lot to, you know, if they eased up, maybe it wouldn't hurt so bad, but when they jump up like that, that it makes a big difference. Especially on a $400 lawnmower. On a big item like this, what do you think about that? Um, unneeded, really, I mean, like I said, I mean, who likes to pay more than they need to? Some shoppers in the third ward weren't fans of paying more either. A two and a half point hike, that's going to make a big difference in, in your budget. Brooke Fishbaugh spent $65 at a boutique. The 5.5% sales tax cost her $3.58. 65 times 0.079, that would make it... Five dollars and fourteen cents. Yeah, that takes it up about two dollars. That's quite a quite a difference. If they were to raise the taxes up like that, I would probably cut back on any large purchases. Leonard Lee paid one hundred and thirty nine dollars at Home Depot on flowers. Seven point nine percent sales tax would have cost him more than eleven dollars. And now I would have to cut back. Uh, a lot of things for people to consider. And Kendall, this deal also includes some requirements for the city and the county. Right, Joyce. Today, Republican lawmakers said Milwaukee would need to add at least 175 detectives and 218 firefighters. It would also require changes to the Fire and Police Commission and who makes policy for the police department. We'll continue to follow this. Kendall Keyes reporting. As